Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this session, I am going to cover Agile, Agile methodology. So, what Agile is all about? Agile is a software development methodology which caters to need which is like business changes, business requirement changes and you need to uh, incorporate those changes in your software development during software development life cycle. So, Agile basically works in that way. Agile is a software development methodology to build software incrementally using short iteration of 1 to 4 weeks so that your development is aligned with the changing business needs. Changing business needs says within a software development you are like in mid of software development and client says no sir I want these changes and to be done within the software uh, with in this software otherwise my software will be rendered useless. But you are in mid of software development you know ok at this point of time if you change something that is a huge impact your development. So, how to deal with it? Agile deal with such things. So, instead of single pass development of 6 to 18 month where requirements and requ risk are predicted upfront, Agile adapts for frequent free feedbacks by incorporating changes after every one month or half a month. So, we have workable product after every one to four weeks of iteration. Basically, what we do? We checks, we make a check to the client, ok sir, so far we have developed this product, can you give feedback on, on it after a month of development? So client C, ok, things are going in line with my requirement, then you can go ahead, oh no, I need these changes, make these changes in the product right now, so that later on I may not feel disgusted. So, let us see how my uh, agile works structurally. So, here we are basically with the traditional method of development and agile method of development. In traditional method, we have ideas, basically requirements we have received from clients, basic requirements because clients say ok this is I want to do, how to do is our responsibility, how to make it done. So, we have ideas from clients, we define it ok, the set of requirements, make a documents with hundreds of requirements written in a short and crisp way, then we define our code, we plan it ok, what to do, how to do, we do class diagrams, everything, then we code it, then we integrate like coding is done by multiple teams, say there are 5 teams, we are they are doing code, then we integrate their code, then our product get ready, then testing team test it and then final software gets prepared. So, it is the first time to get the real feedback from the client. After one and a half year of time, we have developed the complete product, give it to the client, ok sir please check if it is meeting your requirements or not. So, there is no option of feedback in between this particular software development cycle. So, Agile works in that way, ok. No sir, you are not required to give feedback after the product is developed. You can give me feedback, I will give you incremental development. So, I am developing few set of requirements instead of all requirements at one time. So, how things are done? You get the ideas from the client, then we have a cycle we fix ok, we are instead of making all set of requirements done one at a time, we are taking few set of requirements, we code them, we define the requirements ok, these requirements are to be done, we code then test it. A small set of product is developed, it is given to the client to test it, who test, who check the feedback, we check the feedback ok, client is given certain feedbacks ok, change the products review and adjust. Then another set of requirements are made, we have set of requirements which are new and set of requirements which are to be adjusted. Then this cycle refines further and your product is second iteration, it is further refined, you see the bigger one. Now again it is sent to client review, we make adjustments then another iteration again. So, we are refining our products, we are enhancing it day by day, we are reviewing it, adjusting it and finally, the software once received to the client, he has already given multiple times the feedbacks. So, we have incorporated client changes in each and every month. So, that is way how Agile works.